Hello all dinosaurs! So today we will be taking a look at 16 different wild and sea animals from Takaratomi. And right over here we have a few boxes of new figures which include this new gorilla right over here. Okay, so let's open this and have a look. This is a brand new gorilla which is different from the previous version right here. Okay, so this gorilla reminds me of King Kong. So just like pounding his chest and stuff like this so able to move both the arms at the elbow area that's really cool so able to rotate the head as well so that's really really nice you're just gonna place this right over here and it comes with the effect caught inside so let's have a look one adult male gorilla which is also called Silverbacks lives with female gorilla and their children as a group. Yeah, that's right. So, male gorillas are known as Silverback gorillas, okay? So let's move on to our next animal, which is right over here. As you guys can see, we have two. Wow, what is this? We have two hippopotamus and this seems like the scientific name of this breed of hippopotamus so let's open this up comes with a uh, calf a baby hippopotamus look at this looks so cute and it comes with a little piece of like grass right over here I'll place the baby one over there wow there's so many of them it's another one Okay, this is the adult hippopotamus so adorable and in case that you guys do not know hippopotamus are actually more dangerous than a lion in africa yes because they're actually killed more humans than the lions they're actually very ferocious animals very territorial i'll place this over here so we have a family of hippopotamus facts about the hippopotamus which is right over here Kiropopsis Kiropsis Liberisis was found in 1841 at first they live in the rainforest alone however don't get into the water often like hippopotamus do yeah so I'm not too sure so this could be a very different species as compared to the hippopotamus okay so let's take a look at this great white shark, one of my most favorite sea animals. Let's open this and have a look. So great white shark, they, oops, this is actually a dolphin inside the great white shark, so I beg your pardon. So yep, so this is actually a bottom nose dolphin, yeah, I think so. And this is definitely not a great white shark, just place it in the wrong um, box right over here we have a camel Bactrian camel and do you guys know what is the function of the two arms on top of the camel it's basically to store food which is in fact like fats so they can actually store some fats in these two arms and they're able to go without food for days they actually have a food stored in the body next we have some sea turtles over here okay there is an adult sea turtle sea turtle and a baby one so let's this over here let's check out a little young sea turtle it's very adorable Next, let's take a look at the king of the jungle. That's what I love to call it. A lion. Okay, so the lion actually has a very loud roar. It is able to roar and you can actually hear the roars from miles away. So that's a very, very loud roar that it has. Zebras. Do you guys know what is the function of the zebra, the stripes on the zebra? Okay, there's actually a piece of card in, in here but it's written in Japanese so I'm unable to read that. 
So zebras actually stand when they're sleeping. Yeah. And these stripes on his body actually help to prevent mosquitoes from attacking them. Yeah, that's true. Saltwater crocodile. I think this animal right over here has one of the largest bite force in the animal kingdom. I'm serious. Check this out. It definitely reminds me of a dinosaur or a prehistoric creature. Saltwater crocodile. Let's take a look at some of the facts over here. Saltwater crocodiles, it's a big animal which can even cross an ocean. The big ones could attack humans sometimes. That's definitely true. Okay. Next up with a reindeer and Christmas is coming. Yes. Rudolph the Red Nose Reindeer. Have you guys put off that song? I'm pretty sure you, you did. So a nice reindeer over here. These are the antlers. These are pretty dangerous. They can be very, very sharp. Yep, that's right. Chimpanzee. Super intelligent animal. Okay, let's open the box up. Looks like this is a brand new figure as well. Yep, this is a brand new figure. It comes with a banana. Looks so cute. So majority of the new figures, they actually come with um, some food. So chimpanzee, they're primates, they're very close, I would say close relative to the humans, yeah. Chimpanzee right over here, looks so adorable. Let's read some facts about the chimpanzee, shall we? Chimpanzees live in the dry or rainy area, so they can adapt to various environments. They are also known as the carnivore. Uh, I'd say they are omnivores because they uh, eat both the meat and vegetable, and vegetable plant eaters as well. So they are definitely an omnivore. Cheetahs, the fastest land animal on earth right at the moment cheetah check this out it's so slender its body it's really really slender it's aerodynamic built um, to last for race i mean it is built to run fast beluga whale so we just have a look beluga whale can actually use echolocation to help itself find its way. Yeah, so adorable. Next, we have the giant panda. Pandas are very well protected in um, China because at one point of time they were actually endangered. Yeah. But right now I think the population is growing really well. In China especially. Pacific white sided dolphin. So yeah, there you go. That's a Pacific white sided dolphin. So we are we got it mixed up with um, the great white shark box. So the great white shark is actually one of my most favorite sea animals. It has a great sense of smell. You can actually smell like droplets of blood from miles away, and that is true. Spotted seal. Let's take a look at the spotted seal. So we have two spotted seals right over here. One is a pup and one is an adult one. A pup means it is actually a uh, baby, a very young seal. And right over here we have the adult version. So cute. You can actually do this. You can actually place the little pup on top of your body like this. It's so adorable. I don't have much facts about the spotted seal. So if you guys know, do let me know or comment down below. We have a lioness and a cub. Yep. Lioness, it's a female lion. Yep. So in a lion tribe, the 
the lioness actually do most of the hunting. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, this is the baby, the cup. So adorable, oh my goodness, this definitely has to be the most adorable animal in our video today. Right? I think so. So I want you guys to let me know which is your most favorite um, animal from this video. Is it a lion? Is it the crocodile? Do let me know down below, okay? So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.